Imagine the thrill, the anticipation, the sheer excitement as the countdown begins for the Mars mission. As the clock ticks down, every second is a momentous step towards the unknown, towards the first human footprint on the Red Planet. In the command center there's a flurry of activity, engineers, scientists and mission specialists all working in perfect harmony, checking and rechecking systems, ensuring everything is in place for the imminent launch. The atmosphere is electrified with a mixture of nerves and excitement. Inside the spacecraft, the crew members are buckled in, their hearts racing. They exchange glances, nods of reassurance, and shared understanding. This is the culmination of years of preparation, of rigorous training, of countless simulations. They are ready, the final seconds are ticking away, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. And with a thunderous roar the spacecraft lifts off, embarking on a historic journey to Mars. As the spacecraft ascends, it breaks free from Earth's gravity, and heads towards the void of space. At this moment, a sense of exhilaration washes over the crew. It's a sensation unlike any other, a feeling of defying nature, as the bonds of gravity are severed and the endless expanse of the cosmos stretches out ahead. The journey to Mars is not a simple one. It takes months of travel, traversing millions of miles through the vast nothingness of space. But our brave astronauts are prepared. They've trained for years, both physically and mentally, to endure the rigors of such a demanding trek. The initial moments of the mission are fraught with tension as they exit the Earth's atmosphere, a critical phase where meticulous precision is the key. As the spacecraft's engines roar, it propels itself further into the cosmos, leaving behind a trail of brilliant light. The crew watches as Earth, our home, shrinks in size, becoming nothing more than a blue marble against the backdrop of inky blackness. It's a sight that humbles them, reminding them of their mission's magnitude and the monumental human endeavor they undertake. But with this awe-inspiring view comes a set of challenges. The crew must now adapt to life in a zero-gravity environment, a world where up is down and down is up. Every daily task from eating to sleeping becomes an exercise in novelty and adaptation. The physical toll is significant but so is the mental. Isolation, monotony and the constant vigilance required to keep the spacecraft running smoothly present hurdles that the crew must overcome daily. Yet despite these challenges the spirit of exploration and discovery remains undeterred. The crew forges ahead their eyes set on the prize, Mars, the red planet, the next frontier in human space exploration. As they journey through the void they are not just astronauts, they are pioneers, trailblazers pushing the boundaries of human knowledge and capability. The Earth is now a distant memory as the spacecraft hurdles towards the red planet. The journey has begun, and there's no turning back. The path is set, and the adventure is underway. The dream of setting foot on Mars is no longer a fantasy. It's a reality taking shape, one day at a time. After a journey of millions of miles the spacecraft finally approaches Mars. Picture this. A spacecraft, our spacecraft, has been traveling through the vast expanse of space, past the moon, beyond the asteroid belt, and it is now on the threshold of the red planet's gravitational pull. This is not a moment of respite, but rather the beginning of a new, critical phase of the mission, entering Mars's orbit. So you may ask, what does entering Mars orbit mean? It's a bit like parking a car, but in space, where you're moving at thousands of miles per hour, and the parking spot is a precise path around a planet millions of miles away. In order to achieve this feat, the spacecraft must perform what is known as an orbital insertion. This is a delicate maneuver that involves firing the spacecraft's engines at precisely the right time, for precisely the right duration. The aim is to slow the spacecraft down just enough that Mars's gravity can pull it into a stable orbit, but not so much that it crashes onto the planet's surface. But the challenges don't stop there. The spacecraft must also contend with the planet's thin atmosphere, which can cause unpredictable changes in trajectory. And let's not forget about Mars moons, Phobos and Deimos, who are always ready to cause a little cosmic chaos. Despite these challenges, the team back on Earth has planned for every eventuality. They've run countless simulations, made endless calculations, and now, it all comes down to this moment. And then, success. The engines fire, the spacecraft slows, and Mars's gravity gently pulls it into a stable orbit. The team back on Earth breathes a collective sigh of relief. They've done it. They've parked their car in space. Now, the spacecraft is in a perfect position to survey the Martian landscape, to map out the best landing spot, 
and to prepare for the descent, it's a moment of triumph, a testament to human ingenuity and perseverance. The spacecraft is now in orbit, circling the alien world, ready for the next stage of its mission. The moment of truth arrives as the spacecraft begins its descent towards the Martian surface. Now imagine this. You're in a spacecraft, hurtling through the thin Martian atmosphere at breakneck speed. The heat shield below you is glowing red hot, and the craft is shaking as if it wants to break apart. This is what we call the descent, the most perilous part of the journey to Mars. As the spacecraft plunges through the atmosphere, a series of carefully orchestrated events unfold. The heat shield, engineered to withstand temperatures up to 2000 degrees Celsius, protects the spacecraft and its precious human cargo from the intense heat of entry. It's a dance with death, a tango with the unknown. Next, the supersonic parachute, the largest ever constructed for a Mars mission is deployed. It bursts out, filling the Martian sky with its vibrant colors as it slows the spacecraft down to a more manageable speed. It's a sight to behold, a testament to human ingenuity and the audacity of our collective spirit. However, the descent is not without its challenges. The Martian atmosphere is notoriously thin and unpredictable making parachute deployment a tricky endeavor. A fraction of a second off in timing and the mission could end in disaster. It's a high-stakes game of precision and timing, a testament to the prowess of the engineers back on Earth who've poured their hearts and souls into this mission. Inside the spacecraft, the crew is bracing for impact, their hearts are pounding, matching the rhythm of the craft as it plunges towards the surface. They're acutely aware of the risks, the multitude of things that could go wrong, but they also know that they are on the cusp of making history. The tension is palpable, but so is the excitement. They are about to become the first humans to set foot on another planet. With a jolt the spacecraft lands on Mars, a feat that marks a new era in space exploration. The first hour on Mars is a flurry of activity, filled with excitement and awe. As soon as the landing module touches the red Martian soil, the crew immediately springs into action. Their first task? To ensure the safety and integrity of their new home away from home. They check the systems, run diagnostics, and confirm that the landing module is secure and functioning as expected. All the while they are in constant communication with mission control back on Earth reporting their status and findings. Then comes the moment that the whole world has been waiting for, the first images of Mars from the ground level. A robotic arm extends from the module, its camera capturing the stark alien landscape in vivid detail. These images, sent back to Earth, are more than just breathtaking vistas. They are tangible proof of humanity's ability to reach out into the cosmos, to set foot on another planet. But these images are not just for the eyes of the crew or mission control. They are shared with the entire world, broadcast across all continents, reaching into millions of homes. People from all walks of life regardless of their nationality, race or age, are united in this moment, collectively holding their breath as they witness history unfolding before their eyes. The significance of this moment cannot be overstated. This is not just another step in space exploration. It's a giant leap for mankind. The landing on Mars symbolizes the culmination of decades of scientific advancement, of relentless human ambition and curiosity. It's a testament to our ability to dream big and then turn those dreams into reality. But as monumental as this moment is, it's just the beginning. The first hour on Mars is over, but the mission has just begun. The crew now prepares for their next tasks, to explore, to study, and to seek answers to questions that have intrigued us for centuries. The exploration of Mars will continue, opening new frontiers and possibilities for humanity. The Red Planet is no longer a distant, unreachable world. It's a new home, a new frontier, a new chapter in our cosmic journey. In just one hour, history was made, and a new chapter in space exploration was written. We've witnessed the exhilarating countdown, the breathtaking journey through the vastness of space, the nail-biting entry into Mars's orbit, the heart-pounding descent onto the Martian surface and finally the awe-inspiring first hour on Mars. This journey, though filled with tension and uncertainty, has opened up a world of potential and possibilities. The implications of this mission are profound serving as a stepping stone for future expeditions and a testament to human ingenuity and perseverance. We've seen scientific theories put into practice and the unknown become known. The red planet, once a distant dream, now becomes a tangible reality. As we leave our heroes to their mission, we can only wonder, what will they discover next on the Red Planet? The future of space exploration is a mystery waiting to be unraveled, and this is just the beginning.